And I realize God is using me in this season of my life. And I need people to know your emotional pain is not mutually exclusive with your spiritual power. Right. We're going to practice crowning one another. I don't, my, my job is my job, but my husband is my husband. And we do therapy. And it's doing me some good. From the version of who God says I can be, I'm chipping at the wall of my destiny. I'm chipping at the wall of my identity. And this woman gave up, but she recognized that rejection does not mean disqualification. Yeah, so we can blog in peace. Yay! <laughs> yes, y'all, I could not take my days off, so this is what I have to do. But I just saw some people from Rooted, and they are, they brought gifts. Ah, I love my Rooted sisters. It says Women of Faith, Hebrews 11, 1. And basically, it comes with a Rooted shirt. Rooted, I told you, is the women's ministry that I'm in. I'm trying to do both, but I can't. It says Rooted um, Women's Ministry, Salvation, all the things. And then they brought gifts. Oh my gosh, they're so nice. They're so beautiful. I'm so sad. <laughs> So the Know Your Bible, it's like a pocket, all 66 books explained and applied. So good. And then pushing an X through anxiety, breaking free from the grip of worry and stress. A companion to Goliath must fall. And they also gave us Winning Your Spiritual Battles by Tony Evans. Like, what did I do to deserve this? Oh God, oh God. It's so yeah. Okay y'all, so this is the look I'm going with. I'm going with something that's basic, why? Because, um, hello, I wanna be basic. Let me see, because it's not even giving what it's supposed to give, right? Okay, so this is, this shirt is from Zara. As you see, it has like some embroidery detail. I actually have no necklaces, so I'm very naked and I'm gonna wear my natural face just because I just tomorrow's the lawn day so tomorrow is the makeup day but yeah um and then I'm just wearing these black trousers from I actually really like the the I actually like the tan better I do I do okay see black it looks better like, I don't know, black, here's black. And I'm gonna show y'all tan. Y'all, y'all just see how this just looks better. I don't know. Can you see it? It just looks, that's how in my opinion. Okay, makeup time. Okay, it's day two. You already know what's going on. Conference mommy. Hold on, let's leave. We're going to lunch. Yes, we are. So, we're going to lunch first and then the conference. And then Leslie's going to change. Oh yeah, I didn't even show them what, I didn't even show you what you were giving the girls. I'm Very the much. Girls not the church. <laughs> we're going to lunch. We're going to lunch. We're going to lunch. <laughs> so I'm giving lunch. But I got my church outfit in the bag. Okay. <laughs> don't judge us. Hey. God don't judge me. Listen, that's outfit is fine for church. And then you know. Hey. See, sometimes you can't help that you have a big butt. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're getting on. Everybody. Woo. Hey y'all. Yes. Yes. We gotta go. We late.
completely. Okay, okay. Guys, we just got. You know when Nene was like, ooh, child, together. Girl, I pulled up, I said, ooh, thanks. Appreciating your sister and crowning her, not with shame, insecurity, self-loathing, or doubt. Tonight, you're going to have the opportunity to look at another sister, whether you know her or not, and speak highly of her. I go home, I'm a mother and I'm a wife. But I always tune in, no matter where I am, on Sundays to the Potter's House, whether Wednesdays too, I watch Bible study, okay? <laughs> and I know what I need to fill up my cup. And between this beautiful queen right here, sometimes I DM her, and it's the truth, I asked her, could she recommend books for me? And Dr. Anita Phillips gets on the phone with me, and we do therapy. And it's doing me some good. Since we've been married, it's like, I, I don't, my, my job is my job, but my husband is my husband. And I know 
that, and I tell, and I tell my team this, I tell my team this, they know that their quality of life is first priority. Your family is first priority. Nobody sitting at this table gonna be at your deathbed. Let's be clear. We just gonna post that job tomorrow. That's what's gonna happen. Hey, it's about the money. It's about the money. So you take care of what God has trusted you with, your family. Your, and some, you know, and everybody's not married. They don't have that love life, but their love life may be their children. It may be that mother. It may be that 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 person that they're assigned to. That's that's where the work is. That's where the ministry is. Let him hold you and rock you till your fears subside. Until you stop apologizing. <coughs> because you lived. Stop apologizing. Because you didn't get to be the homecoming queen. Because other people didn't deem you worthy. Tonight. God is calling you worthy. God is saying you're worth it. God is saying that you're all together lovely. And that you are the apple of his eye. God is in Hashanah. God is in the room. Looking for somebody that would dare to live. A transformational leader. It's time for you to be released to watch. The unreached with raw authenticity, calling women out of their past into their God given destiny. Help me see it, God. She is a wife, mother, New York Times best selling author, co pastor of One LA, and the founder of Woman Evolve. Somebody's going to walk out of this place and break the door down. Pastor Sarah Jakes Robbins. and thou art loose. The grand bishop, the honorable, my daddy, my daddy. From the version of who God says I can be, I'm chipping at the wall of my destiny. I'm chipping at the wall of my identity. And this woman gave up, but she recognized that rejection does not mean disqualification. The revolution does not stop just because I have been rejected. The rejection only repositions me. The rejection only changes the way that I position myself. That means you can break my heart, but you can't change the way I feel about marriage because rejection does not mean that I am disqualified. It just means I am repositioned. Rejection is an opportunity for me to reposition. It is my way of being able to say, it did not work out here, but that does not change my destination. I still have a revolution to start. This woman understood that mentality. So if you are not ready for me at this church, I'll go to a different church where I can start this program. If the bank says it will not happen in my community, that is okay. I'll fundraise the money on my own. You see, there are some women in this room who have been rejected but not taken out of the game because they saw rejection as an opportunity to reposition. You think I got here because everything went as planned. Absolutely not. Everything actually fell apart and I took those broken pieces and repositioned because at the end of the day, the goal is the goal. The destination is the destination. And even though I may reject it, be rejected from this path, I accept it as a detour to the next stage. Rejection doesn't stop the revolution. It just repositions it. Women know how to work around walls. When it didn't work out here, Marie just 
moved around that wall. This isn't a foreign concept for us as women. There are women who have climbed the corporate ladder, not because it was so easy to take one step after another step, but because they worked around the wall to find the ladder in the first place. And they got to one level only to find that the ladder doesn't, ladder doesn't keep extending. You got to work around a different wall. I got to change my lane. Work in progress and I know who's working on me. So I am done trying to play cute and I am done trying to be accepted. I'm ready to be anointed for real. I am done trying to make sure that I'm the perfect little lady so some man can pick me up. I want to be the perfect little image of God. Ooh. Hey y'all, it is day three, I think, or the last day. Day three, the last day. Man. You already know. Last night was good. I inserted the clips. You saw it. This is off. But I inserted a lot of clips. <laughs> it was good. And yeah, that's how it went down. So, yeah. So today, 